channel for physics. Please subscribe my channel. Hello and welcome back to another episode of Physics Partner. Walton Hufen was an electrical engineer who founded the first institute for electrical engineering in Austria in 1883. He is known for creating an apparatus that demonstrates the effects of eddy current induced in a piece of copper moving in a magnetic field which is known as Walton Hoofen's pendulum. The apparatus consists of a pendulum with a curved strip of copper at its lower end, arranged so that it hangs between the poles of an electromagnet. When the magnetic field is switched on, the oscillations of the pendulum are damped and die away rapidly due to the induced eddy currents within the copper strip. You can see here on the screen. However, when the copper strip has slots cut into it, and it's replaced with a similar pendulum, the oscillations are less damped, even with the presence of a magnetic field. This is because although an EMF is still induced in the metal, eddy currents cannot flow across the gaps, allowing the pendulum to swing more freely. This effect demonstrates the position of motion caused by the magnetic fields created by the eddy current in accordance with Lenz law. Let's talk about the finding of this experiment. The finding were that the oscillations of the pendulum are heavily damped and die away rapidly when the magnetic field is switched on due to the induced eddy current within the copper strip. When the copper strip has slot cut into it and it's replaced with a similar pendulum, the oscillations are much less damped, whether the magnetic field is present or not. This is because eddy current cannot flow across the gaps, allowing the pendulum to swing more freely you can see here on the screen and you can easily observe the difference of the oscillations. So let's talk about the application of this pendulum. Walton Hoofen's apparatus consisting of a pendulum was primarily used as a teaching tool for demonstrating the principles of eddy currents and magnetic damping in physics. While there may not be any practical real life applications for the specific apparatus, the concepts it demonstrates have a wide range of application in various industries such as electrical engineering, material science, and non-destructive testing. Eddy currents are used in non-destructive testing techniques to detect flaws or discontinuities in conductive materials. Magnetic damping is used in various applications such as in the design of mechanical systems where it is used to control the motion of moving part and reduce vibrations. So I think it's enough for today. So thank you very much for listening and watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope this video is useful for you. So take care of yourself and don't hesitate to write an email if you have any question, query, suggestion and even classes are required. Take care of yourself. Meanwhile, see you in the next video. Goodbye.